Hi, I'm Rhonda Church Finfrock, a Fruitful Life studio located inside Rocky Hill Antiques in Exeter, California. Today's video is all about super salt wash. I use salt wash when I want to speed up the layering of paint and add lots of texture as well as camouflage some flaws that might be in my furniture piece. Life is a winding road bought this little cabinet on Facebook Marketplace because I just adored the mosaic. So I started off by masking the mosaic with painter's tape, mixing just a bit of salt wash into my DIY sea glass paint and pounced that texture all over the cabinet, especially in the places that were worn and chippy. Before the paint and salt wash dry completely, I knocked down the peaks with my chip brush. Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down To freshen up that shiny old paint on the inside, I squirted in some DIY Queen Bee and pushed it around with my insider brush, then rolled it on quickly. Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down, but we get up and start from the ground. After going over the sea glass and salt wash layer with a top coat of Queen Bee, it was time to put on my mask and sand back that layer to reveal the sea glass underneath. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Even if the sky is falling down yeah. the sky is falling. With the beautiful mosaic revealed, it was time to choose some colors for accents. I dry brushed on many layers of DIY paint. Look for the list near the end of this video. Even if the sky is falling down Even if the sky is falling down yeah. The sky is falling down uh, um, yeah. To seal the inside of this cabinet for more durability, I used DIY Big Top Top Coat. One of the cabinet knobs was broken, so I replaced both of them with the IOD wooden knobs and the knob topper stamp set. I should have watched that video that the sisters came out with because it would have helped me avoid the ring around the knob that I got from the ink. I covered up the ink rings on the knobs using DIY's Pennies from Heaven Copper Patina and accented the rest of the piece with it as well. I sealed the knobs with DIY's Big Top Top Coat and then I took shipwrecked verdigris wax to accent the knobs as well as clean up the grout in the mosaic. That beautiful turquoise wax made that mosaic just pop. Found what we're looking for in life. Us crazy, but things are finally right. With you and I, the future is bright. To seal this beautiful boho cabinet, I used buttery smooth DIY clear wax to bring out all the pigments.
Thank you for watching this video featuring Super Speedy Salt Wash. It really helped me make this a quick upcycle. You can purchase this along with DIY paints, IOD products featuring the knobs and the knob topper stamps right on my website, fruitfullifestudio.com.